Okay, so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be looking at the cosine ball. Okay, a squared equals b squared plus c squared minus 2bc cos a. And we define the triangle as follows. The angles are in capital letters and the sides are in lowercase. So that would be a, b, c. So that's a, c, and b. Okay, and if we're looking at this, we're trying to find this length here. And all the things in the equation are these, B, C, and A. So you've got to make sure two adjacent sides with the angle between them, and everything works out fine. So I'm going to put a, a, a triangle here, and we're going to try and solve the triangle. We're going to try and get all the bits of information about it. This is 11.2. This is 7.8. This is 36 degrees. Okay. Okay, I just got my calculator so we can start this. So we'll find first this side here. So we're thinking this is the angle A, this is the side A, this is B, this is C. So we're going to write A squared equals B squared plus C squared minus 2 times 7.8 times 11.2 times cosine. 36. So we'll just stick that all into the calculator. Okay, 11.2 squared plus 7.8 squared equals minus in brackets 2 times 7.8 times 11.2 times cosine 36 close brackets. Equals. So I've got A squared is 44.93, which means that A is equal to the square root of that which is 6.70, okay? So now we need to calculate another angle. Let's choose this angle here, okay? And so don't forget the 6.70 we can put here now. Okay, and so we're going to solve for this angle here, okay? So if, we, if you want to think of it in terms of A and A squared, this now becomes A, this is big A, this is B, and this is C, okay? And so we solve a squared, 7.8 squared equals b e squared plus c squared, 11.2 squared plus 6.7 squared minus 2 times 11.2 times 6.7 times cosine a. Okay, so we're just going to solve that, 7.8 squared minus 11.2 squared minus 6.7 squared equals, and divide by 2, divide by 11.2, divide by 6.7, and we have 0 0.7295 equals cosine A. So A equals, okay, times, so shift cosine answer equals, 43.15. Now we can find the third angle is 90 minus 43.15 minus 36. So 180, not 90, 180. So let's do that. 180 minus 43.15 minus 36 is equal to 101 degrees. Okay, so now the triangle that we were trying to fix looks like this. This one is 43.2. This is 101. This was given as 36. Notice the point 0.2 is a little extra. This is 7.8 here. Uh, 7.8. This is 11.2. And this is 6.7. That's how to use the cosine rule.